This is video from inside the Clark County Jail on August 13th, 2021. The Sheriff's Office says deputies in the Maximum Security Unit were retrieving food trays from a cell they say housed an inmate with a history of violence, including previous assaults on corrections officers. But it is unclear what led to this takedown of the already cuffed inmate by a deputy and others eventually piling on. We do know Sheriff Chuck Atkins, after seeing this, was concerned enough to immediately place Corrections Deputy Robert Hanks on administrative leave and launch both internal and criminal investigations. After watching the video, I think the force was a bit excessive. Although not connected to this case, Attorney Jason Kafuri has handled many other use of force cases. As for this one... Um, it's hard without knowing what was said to understand why the guards did what they did. Uh, but in general, it seemed, especially since he was cuffed, to be more force than was necessary. But Kafori's not surprised by what he sees here. We just as the public got an eye-opening video because there was a video in this particular incident. But the reality is this is happening to people in jail all the time. Another potentially concerning element is the use of tethers on the inmate and the force used by deputies to pull the jailed man's arms through his cell door opening to release the cuffs. Sheriff Atkins is asking for patience, saying it is vital we review and consider all the variables for the integrity of the investigation and not prejudge this incident based solely on the video. We've not been told the name of the inmate or whether he was injured. You can see him here apparently checking his wrists and arms after the incident. So again, two investigations, and the criminal investigation was conducted by the Pierce County Sheriff's Office. They've now finished their work and their reports in the hands of the Clark County prosecutor. He tells me this afternoon he has a team looking at that, but it's not clear when they'll make a decision on any charges. We also want to let you know that we've got these videos up at KGW.com.